Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Brett at 9mm USA here. And today we've got a special video for you. We're gonna take a tour of Tracker Safe. This is the first type of video we've ever done like this. So let's go inside and see what Tracker Safe's all about. Hey, Brett. Hey. Hey, hey, Sean, how are you doing? Welcome to the Vancouver Tracker Safe Show. Very nice to meet you. Guys, this is Sean from Tracker Safe. He's the Vancouver, Washington manager. So Good to have you here. Nice to be here. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah. All these beautiful safes. Can you tell us about some of them? Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll just kind of give you a dessert tray of information and we'll go from there. Okay, Sean, show us this safe right here. What's this one all about? Absolutely. Uh, this is our TS series. This is a very popular series. All of these gray safes right here are 30 minute fire protection. They're going to have 12 gauge steel. Uh, they all come with UL listed locks. You have the option of a dial or electronic on these. Uh, the electronics are great. They're, uh, all the batteries change from the front. A lot of people are concerned about this. This lifts up right here. This is a Cura RAM, which is a great lock. 9 volt battery right here. Has a telephone type jack. If anybody was to compromise or mess with this lock, you could get from us or a reputable locksmith a new keypad pretty easily. Okay. So, uh, Brett Senior, if you'd open that baby Absolutely. up. Absolutely. Nice. So the TS series is going to come standard with this gray interior, just regular carpet, which is nice. It's going to come with two shelves. A lot of people will put this shelf up here for storage if they don't want to use the whole capacity for rifles. Yeah. Uh, the rails allow you to adjust stuff. Clips right there. There's going to be two pre-drilled bolt-down holes for the bottom. Those legs down there are just for shipping. It's okay. just for shipping. Um, the top shelf is definitely adjustable. This number here, TS is just Tracker Safe, it's our Tracker Safe series. That number on there indicates how many long rifles we say it will hold. It would depend on your collection, of course. And you can always split that number in half uh, if you know it's going to be like 12 on one side, you're going to use the other side for animal cans or personal belongings and family stuff. How thick are the bolts on this safe? So the bolts on this safe are one inch steel bolts and they're all the way around. Also there's back bolts here too. Uh, to make sure that if somebody was wildly and cut off your hinges, that the door still will be hard to open. And so those are welded in place, right? Correct, correct. Okay. Uh, the door does feature that full opening position so you get a little more room to get in your stuff. Yeah, it really does open wide. That's mm -hmm. nice. So the TS series is definitely affordable and it's uh, just a good family safe to start with. Makes total sense. And like you said, Sean, if you only have a few rifles, then that's fine. Put your few rifles over here on this side. If you want to add additional shelves that are right here, you can add those going all the way up and make this more handguns over here, rifles over here, or the bottom section down here could be for ammo, and then add handguns and have some handguns or stuff like that up here also. So yeah, there's a lot of room in that safe. All right, so let's check out the alternative to this safe, which would be offered in the M series, correct? Correct. So this is your most standard series. These safes are super popular in a lot of homes. Some people want more protection, more fire rating, and also a lot more whistles and bells. So let's go look at this one's brother or sister, the M22, okay? So Brett, a senior, if you'd open that up for us. Thank you. I think I will. Nice. Sweet. So as you can see already, there's a little more whistles and bells in this one for sure. Yeah, you have a full accessory door panel there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, some of the big things that stick out between this and the TS series is this has 11 gauge steel, so thicker steel. Okay. So for forced entry and attacks and stuff like that. Uh, you definitely have the door organizer with Velcro and stuff that moves things around. Very sought after feature for pistols. You can hang a shotgun from there. Uh, some uh, people put like jewelry bags or cash or money in those areas. And it gives a lot more room for the door. Uh, this safe also features internal power, which is nice down there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that's on all the M series. Correct. This entire series comes with that. Uh, we're in the Northwest and some people on the East Coast or anywhere you have humidity, dehumidifiers are a big deal. Mm -hmm. And then also being able to put a light source in easily and just plug into the wall is great. Uh, this series offers a little more security as far as bolt down. There are four bolt down holes, so you can really, really mount that guy down. Yeah. And this also does have the 1.25 inch diameter bolts. Yeah, there's bigger bolts and more of them too. So front door attacks are gonna be pretty intense. Yeah. All of these safes, including the TS series we talked about earlier, have relocker pins and drill plates inside for any kind of attack to the lock. 
I really like it that it has the internal power package because we've already hooked up our golden rods. And lights and all that. And so everything totally works great. accessorize the safe. You know, in a lot of stuff right now, uh, Brett Senior, uh, there's a lot of digital optics. Uh, there's a lot of uh, cool, like if I was going out to the range and I was using my iPad to help me calibrate my scope or whatever, I could have that pre-powered and ready to go, which is cool. And a lot of law enforcement and people who have radios and things like that have, like to have that ready too. That's true. That's a huge advantage. All right, what do we want to cover next? Well, a lot of people always want a quick access entry type safe for their yeah. houses. Uh, things for prescription drugs, things for their pistol or firearm, things they just don't want other members of their family to mess with. Right. And uh, you being an extremely uh, pistol guy sticks out to me. Right. And I think you'd be really interested in the S series, oh. both for quick access, small places, inside cars, home defense type situations. Oh. So Brett Senior, these are our S series safes. These are super, super popular safes for homes. Uh, there's all kinds of ways to get into these. Uh, your finger will be able to access that. Now we put in his fingerprint earlier uh, so he could actually see how fast that is. Really accessible. And tell him about how easy that was. That was very easy. That's so simple. And it doesn't really matter, guys, if it's daytime or nighttime or whatever. You find the keypad and you just press the corner button right here and then it lights up. You can see where you put your finger. That's awesome. I like it a lot. And that'll do up to 30 fingerprints. So you could have uh, multiple family members or yourself having access. Right. Um, the other neat thing about this particular safe is it does have a key backup if everything goes uh, bad, you know, electronics or the battery dies. You also have a 10 digit keypad of your choice where you could program in your own private code and that's on the front there. So go ahead and close that safe and hit star real quick. Yeah, there we go. And now just hit one, two, three, four and star if you wanted to open it with your key access. Sorry, yeah. So you could do that too. So you have all three. Uh, the 14 gauge steel, it got a good thick door, it bolts down front or back, and the shelf is not really adjustable, but you could take it out, which is nice. This is perfect for folks that have small children or something like that, but they still want to have their pistol available to them for defensive purposes. You could have this right next to your bed, your master bedroom, in the master closet, whatever, have easy access to it that happens pretty quickly. And also, my feelings on it is, Something like this one right here, wouldn't this be perfect like if you had an SUV or a pickup truck or something like that and you could put multiple uh, pistols in here, a couple of pistols in here or one pistol with multiple magazines. This would be absolutely perfect. There's too many weapons that are stolen out of vehicles these days and there's no reason for it, especially if you take something like this and bolt it into your car, they're not going to be able to steal it out of your car. So. There's the safety aspect, and then there's the theft aspect. And quick access. And quick access, yeah. I think they're really cool. So that's the S-Series uh, in a nutshell, and uh, it's just, they're, they're very, very popular because easy to program, uh, and you have the individuality of the different fingerprints. Other neat accesses for that is, uh, let's say you and a partner have a business together, uh, and you may have to let an employee go or something like that. You could just have the fingerprint access and then give the code to your employees, take that code away, but keep your fingerprint access. And you could also be the owner of the keys, which is really nice. And it's great for families like that if you're worried about a you know, family member having access that shouldn't. So. I really like the idea of having you and your spouse be able to have their own fingerprints uh, registered here so either one of you can get into the safe and get a hold of your firearm. Yep. Nice. Sean, what other kind of safes do you offer here at Vancouver Tracker Safes? Well, we're kind of a full, uh, full meal deal, if you will. Uh, we have security deposit safes, uh, home security safes, uh, small fire office safes, uh, floor safes, uh, and like some hidden access type stuff, which is nice. But one of the ones that is very popular, especially with a lot of your people, mm -hmm. are the pistol safes, quick access stuff or easy hiding hole stuff. This SPS and this SPS01, they're small steel boxes, but the neat part about this is if I have this in my vehicle, I can be compliant in some states for traveling with my pistol. Mm -hmm. uh, this is really neat in uh, you know, like motorbike saddle bags and stuff like that. Oh, but yeah. when I'm going to a hotel room somewhere and I can't take it into a place because my concealed carry doesn't cover that, uh, this is great. Key access, you pop that baby open, Shums like this. This safe is great because it will hold a full-size pistol and a magazine. 1911, a Glock. Nice. Uh, you know this uh, this Walther replica here. Steel lanyard allows you to put it around your seat track or you know in a saddlebag and get your bike frame. Oh yeah. Stuff like that, which is really great. And uh, I'll uh, hand this to you just to give you an idea. It's 14 gauge steel. It's legit. I mean. Yes, it's not the end all for protection, right. but you could see. Yeah. And they're not meant to be quick access. So hopefully you're never having to go for your stuff that quick, but 
this is great for light security right now. Absolutely. So yeah, and if you can check that out, go ahead and put that key there. And I put it on my keychain in my car, and I just there I am. I'm ready to go. Yeah, that's pretty quick. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I like it that that prevents prying eyes from getting their hands on stuff. Mm -hmm. And they're great for other things too. I mean, in a lot of states where they have prescription drugs that you can, you know, you don't want your children touching and stuff like that. And very cost effective guys, obviously. So this other safe over here is the quick access pistol safe mm -hmm. or the quaps. Mm -hmm. You can totally customize your code to get in it. It's like playing a piano here. There's four buttons here. You put your fingers on it and you're in. So you can totally store a full size pistol in here like a Glock 17. Right. This would be a Walther P99 style pistol. Another unique uh, feature is it does have the key bypass. Mm -hmm. One thing I really like about this safe is it has an alarm. So if you have a, a young child in your home, perhaps, or a bad guy who wants to play around with your stuff, if you push these buttons a number of times, about four incorrect entries, this very distinct alarm goes off and lets you know, hmm, I should probably go see what's going on. Right. Yeah. Nice. So what steel is this safe made out of? That one's 14 gauge steel. Okay. Uh, it does have mounting points on the bottom, so you can actually bolt it down. And we always recommend bolt every safe down. Yeah. Uh, if you couldn't, at least this would have some level of protection in your home, so somebody can't just touch your stuff. So what is this over here? So this is actually one of our deposit safes. Now this is a non-fire insulated heavy steel fire safe. Uh, this is really meant for businesses that need a drop box. This could be used for all kinds of things, uh, but primarily employee comes and gets done with the shift. He'll put his deposit or whatever that manager wants in there. That'll drop into this container here. And this has two different compartments, which some companies want. Uh, they want this area for their deposits and this area for the nightly drop. Uh, the neat thing about this guy, really heavy steel and uh, pretty intense safe. You can see the thickness of the door there. Wow. Uh, and this is, this, is, this is neat. If you're a business owner and you want these capacities, having the bottom container areas nice. If I wanted my log books or things that I don't want employees to touch, that would be down there. And of course, this would be the nightly manager type stuff. Nice. So. So, young Beretta, let's take a look at what other safes they have available here okay. in the showroom. So, you guys are a dealer of American security safes. We are, and uh, the nice thing about American security is this is a, a U.S. made option for our clients, which is great. Uh, these are manufactured in uh, California, and we do keep a decent stock in supply here and also at our Seattle store, which is nice. So guys, this American security safe has a lot of steel in it. Actually has a handle to be able to pull it because the door is so heavy. So the door is very heavy because it has a half inch of solid steel in the door itself. And those are one and a half inch chrome bolts all the way around, so that's nice too. Massive. Mm -hmm. Massive bolt system here. Go ahead and open it up so they can and see And of that. course it's made right here in America. For those of you that are interested in an American-made product, you can definitely contact them and talk to them about the American security here at Tracker Safe. And it is four-way bolt work, as you guys can see. The door is heavy. It's got some solid steel in it. Wow, look at the bolts all the way on the inside, too. Of course, they're at the top and at the bottom also. So with this safe, you would get a full accessory door panel here. And this is some very nice interior right here. You also do get a lighting kit with this, and it is motion activated, correct, Sean? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What gives it that 120 minute fire protection uh, is that that is 11 gauge body with their proprietary concrete lining. Let's show that. And a 14 gauge interior lining. So this is a pretty significant safe. So guys, over here at Tracker Safes, they do offer a ton of safe accessories for a gun safe. Got some wall safes right here. So if you want to mount it in the wall, you have a couple to choose from on that. So Sean, what are these right here? So these are our home security line of safes and all of these could be used for these applications, but this is more of your traditional safe that you put family documents in uh, and things that have uh, value to you that you don't need a big, you know, a gun safe per se. Yeah, handguns. Uh, yeah, but handguns are perfect for this. People put them in travel trailers and stuff. This has 12 gauge steel, relocker pin, drill plate, good UL listed locks and significant weight to them, so they're definitely a deterrent. Of course, they can be bolted down, too. And that's more than big enough for at least eight to 10 pistols or 
you know, a couple of pistols and multiple magazines, ammo, or whatever else you want to put oh, in there. Oh, absolutely, here. absolutely. Nice. They have the back bolts and the front bolts too, so, you know, you're going to have to, if you're a bad guy, you're going to have to work hard. All right, that's very nice. Let's talk about the M45 or the big guy. Well, I think, if I recall, you got one of these yourself. Yeah. It's pretty exciting. Yeah. And uh, uh, we loaded this one with some stuff so the customers could see uh, probably how they might have, you know, their safe at home. Uh, this one does feature a mechanical lock on it right now, and uh, that's kind of nice. Uh, but commonly, I know, Britta Sr., you have a lot of firearms, and you'll, of course, have your own concept of how you want it. But, uh, you know, this is what I did. Uh, with our stuff so it's fun to see and uh, yeah just uh, if you want to talk about some of those things and features and I know you have one too so it'd be interesting to see what you're gonna do with yours yeah absolutely so Sean you brought all this stuff in for video purposes today this is not something you normally yeah use. these all these all go home to their owners and get locked up tonight all right, so. All right. so basically a bunch of rifles guys um, on these two sections they've got it all set up and I don't know somewhere in the neighborhood of 15 or so rifles all set well, up. Well, this one will do 45 pretty confidently. You'll fill all three bays, of course, but. Yeah, yeah. and then over here, we've got uh, lots of ammo cans down at the bottom. You wanna keep your heavier items, like boxes of ammo, um, crates of ammo, stuff like that, down at the bottom. That's where it should be. So you're not putting a ton of stress on your shelves. Exactly. You can have lots of loaded uh, magazines up here, extra pistols, there's an ammo can right here for additional ammo. So it can hold the weight, it's not like it can't, but I just like to put a lot of my heavy, heavy stuff on the bottom. We've got some nice go bags here ready to go, um, some accessories here, you can put pistols up here. And then one of the things I love about my safe guys is the accessory door panel here. You've got multiple places for pistols. You can add even more of these in the open space as long as they don't bang together. Here's a full size six inch 357 Magnum right here and a Mossberg shotgun. I could put my shockwave over here on my safe and have it just go right in here to this pouch. It holds it, keeps it in place. It's very usable right there. Multiple magazines right here in these locations here. Magazines up above and then you have pouches down below for whatever you want to put in them. I know uh, uh, young Greta has used one of his major pouches to put all of his uh, MPX magazines in. Yeah. So he's got a bunch of MPX magazines that are fully loaded and ready to go and they're right here easily accessible. So you grab the MPX, you grab the magazines and you're ready to, to do whatever you need to do. So I, I'm a big fan, big fan of the uh, door panel. Um, highly encourage people to consider that when you're purchasing a safe. I love it. So guys, this M45 has internal power right down there. It's set up for three different plugins. Plus it has, uh, is it a USB? Mm -hmm. Two of them, yeah. So it's got two USBs down there also. You'll notice on uh, my safe review from the house that we, we've got uh, lights all hooked up throughout the whole safe. We also have a golden rod hooked up. Yeah. So that power port right there is very valuable and it's on all the M series safes. So from the largest one, which is this one, to the smaller ones, which are to my left. So if you're interested in something that has those capabilities, definitely look at the M series here if you're interested in that internal power. And it's, you've, you've got to have it. If you have multiple firearms, you, you need to have it so you don't have any rusting issues. And since we put them in, we've had zero issues. So it works. So guys, this safe does have configurable shelving. So if you have a lot of AR type rifles or carving type rifles, you can move these things up or down. Also, it has an opening up here at the top. So if you have long guns like uh, goose guns or hunting guns or 50 cal sniper rifle, it can actually go through this opening right here and still fit inside your safe. It's a great safe overall. I've been very happy with it, guys. I do highly recommend it if you're wanting a larger safe. And to be honest with you, they sell for a great price. So if you want a larger safe and you don't want to break the budget, this is one you need to look at. Vancouver Tracker Safe is the place to go if you live locally. So for more information, you can always come to Tracker Safe here in Vancouver, Washington to our showroom. Or you can give us a call at 360-213-0363. And you can always reach us online at trackersafe.com. Sean, thanks so much for hosting us here at Tracker Safe. We really appreciate it. Well, I'm glad to have you here, Brenda Senior, and I think you're going to like your safe for life. So I think I'm going to love the safe. Thanks for watching, everyone. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel here on YouTube, Brett and 9mm USA, for more guns and gear videos coming up in the future.